Good morning, everybody. Today we're doing a week in my life. We're starting it on a Wednesday. We're doing Wednesday to a Friday situation. I just woke up about an hour ago and it's Wednesday, so we post a new episode of Gals on the Go and I always upload a new vlog on Wednesdays as well. So I've just been doing all the posting, all the things, promoting those episodes. It's literally Christmas morning when I post a new video. I don't think you guys understand. Like, I love you guys. <laughs> um, but I've got the Yule log going. I'm just now getting dressed. I'm about to go work out. I, as you guys know, I joined Equinox, but I'm still working out with my trainer Jane once a week. I went from three week, three times a week to once a week with her. Um, and we're gonna see how it goes. So I'm headed to go see her now. It's pretty chilly outside. It's the chilliest it's been this fall so far. It's like 45 right now. I think it's going up to 50, but it's gonna stay at 50. Thankfully, it's a sunny day, so we'll take that. Um, but yeah. We're doing all kinds of things today. Sierra, my interior designer, is coming in today to kind of see the apartment. She hasn't seen it with everything in it. We're gonna kind of do some final touches and like, there's like, I wanna get like artwork for that area, maybe a new lamp, just, you know, things that we're gonna chat about. And then tonight we actually have two events. One is my really good friend Kelly Ann's soft launch party for her platform she's releasing and I'm so excited for her and then right after that I'm going to an event with Cloudy Bay they're a wine company and it's like a dinner so I'm really really excited for both of those things I'm um, doing lots of things in between and then tomorrow is more of a chill day we're gonna go to a coffee shop we're gonna get some work done at least that's the goal tomorrow I really want to dedicate time to myself to get stuff done because I've been go 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 um, and then Friday we have a gals on the go shoot there's just things happening so that's me giving you guys a lay of the land for the week. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Subscribe if you guys are new here. Follow me on Instagram at Danielle Carolyn. I've been like obsessed with my Instagram stories lately, not to toot my own horn. Um, but yeah, comment down below if there's any other videos you guys want other than vlogs. Please let me know. I want to do like a fall morning slash night routine soon. I know you guys like unedited day in my life, so just let a girl know, you know? So we're getting ready right now for the gym. I'm wearing this set from Story, of course. And then as for shoes, to do weight training. Where the heck are they? Oh, here they are. I wear these APL sneakers because they're flat and then I'm gonna need a jacket and socks. I'm gonna need two jackets because I want to wear this hoodie from Princess Polly but then wear like a lighter jacket over top. Like this could be cute. This jacket from Revolve, it's from um, Elsa Husk's collection. Do those go? They're just gonna have to. Okay, let's we got one. This one is super warm, and I got it like a little bit bigger of a size, so it just keeps me nice and warm, and it's just cozy, slouchy. I feel like this might actually not go, but we're gonna see. I'm literally late. But this does not go at all. This can't happen. See, this is when... I start to stress and then I throw things on the ground, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna put it on the hanger. It takes two more extra seconds. So I don't have to clean this up later. I know this will work. I have this jacket from American Eagle. Wore it in my, actually no, I didn't wear it in my last one. Ugh. Oh yeah, this is so cute. Way better, perfect. And then we'll get the high socks going for extra warmth. Anything you can do for added warmth. I'm gonna be I'm gonna step outside and be sweating probably. Oh I forget I have this little balcony now. So I can step outside to test my outfit and make sure that it's warm enough or too warm. I feel like I'm doing like a get dressed with me TikTok. <laughs> my toxic trait is like if my shoelaces are tied on the sneakers, I just try to like force my foot in, which is not good for the shoe probably. Okay. Fit check, we're good. This is kinda cute. I love a little layering moment. Alright. I'm late, let's go work out. Back from my workout now, I'm starving. 
So I always get super hungry after I work out. I'm gonna do cauliflower thins with turkey, and then I'm gonna need more. So I kinda wanna make green beans really quick, so I have these left over, but also I don't really have time to make garlic, cause Sierra's gonna be here soon. I can still like cook the, I don't know. We'll do that in a sec. I'm gonna eat this first just cause I'm so hungry, and then we'll make some more food in a little bit. Okay, I just tidied up a little bit. That area is just still a little messy, but I cleaned my counters. I like kinda, I like took stuff off the floor of the closet room. That stuff needs to stay there, otherwise I won't remember to do those things. Um, but yeah, just so Sierra has kind of like, just so Sierra has a nice vibe. But I'm still hungry, so I'm gonna make a little salad. We're doing butterhead lettuce, Italian dressing, and some mozzarella real quick, like a nice little easy meal. So usually I make this salad with arugula and then I also add tomato by the way, but I think this is gonna be tasty. Okay guys, Sierra's here. Sierra Belanger interior. She is the best. I pronounce it right, Sierra Belanger. Yeah, you're so good every time. I'm so good, okay, yay. I really try. Um, so, as you guys know, all the table drama, there's always a saga. There's a couch saga, there's a table saga, whatever. So, I put it here, not under Sierra's recommendation. Actually, the day that she got engaged. Yes. <laughs> I was like posting my story, I had no idea. I'm like, I'll get you tomorrow. Yeah, she was like, I would say let's talk now, but I just got engaged. I was like, oh my gosh, don't worry. <laughs> so this is where I have the table right now. She does not like it, um, and it's fair. It's not, it's more of her functionality. So we're gonna like play around and move some things around and, and see, we're gonna visualize we're gonna together. We're gonna play. Yes, we're gonna play. All right, guys, things have changed around here. Um, so the table is over here. I don't hate it. I'm just trying to think like if I'm, I'm I told Sierra I'm gonna live in it for a few days mm -hmm. and I'm gonna text you. We're gonna chat um, I do I think it looks really pretty. It feels very open Unfortunately, that means I'll have to move the TV over which is super its own the super saga But I'm excited to see how the lanterns look here at night The mirror is now here comment down below your thoughts guys. I just need some opinions It definitely feels really open when you like walk in right here. So I'm excited. It's fun, it's fun to play around. I'm thankful that everything was pretty much easy too. We're strong gals. Yes, <laughs> well, the one thing we're not strong enough to do is these snaps, these curtains like snap on. I think I need to get like pliers or something to like, I'm just not yeah. strong enough. And then um, the rug, we're gonna move this way just so like it's centered, the, the couch is centered in the rug and pull the rug back a little bit so the rug's not gonna bump into the chairs and we're just gonna feel it out. Oh, and she also talked about doing like mirrors on either side of the TV, like organic shaped, as you said, right? You look so cute with your Starbucks so full. I love this for you. But yeah, so that is what's going on here. Oh, I need to update them on the hallway too. Mm -hmm. So this hallway is very grand. Obviously this all isn't gonna go where it is right now. Um, but I do feel the importance to keep my glass right here because I don't have any room in my kitchen, quite frankly. <laughs> but, um, she brought the idea of getting like a very tiny, like super tiny little bench, but long, um, and putting like a throw pillow or something and like maybe hanging something above here. She said like mirrors on the hallway, something like that. You guys know I love my mirrors. And I really liked that idea. I thought I would like add some coziness because she did make the point, like this hallway, you guys, I don't know if you can see how, like it is big. This hallway is very big and it's the first thing you kind of see when you walk in. And we're trying to figure out, I have an extra chair so I will be selling. If any of you guys want it, please DM me. Please take it, I have an extra chair. This is a crate and barrel chair. Um, but, so this won't be here. So it's gonna be somewhere else or it's gonna be sold. This, trying to figure out where to put it. I really don't know where this is gonna go. But yeah, so that's the update. I'm having Sierra do her magic and decorate my console. I was like, I forget how to do it. <laughs> Not actually, but I just like, you know, this is your thing. This is my thing. This is your thing, I girl. Know. I love it. Okay guys, so I think I'm actually gonna be able to put this in the corner of my bedroom behind my closet door, like when it opens. So that's great, so this will be more open. Put this chair in here for now. And then we just measured and my Ikea Alex drawers that I haven't built yet are actually going to fit perfectly right here. It's gonna be tight, but these are like summery tops and I can still like push them like so much. There's still a lot of room on these rods, which is great. Um, it'll be so nice, I'm getting ready. Oh, I wanna try a new product, boom, done. So, and it's like 45 inches high. So I'm excited to get those built. 
put them there. Things are happening. We were just saying I kind of want my goal to like have my apartment kind of done in a month. I really want to be able to do an apartment tour like I did last year. So yeah, we shall see how this all goes. Okay, I just finished getting ready. I was really stressed because it's a makeup event and I'm like, my makeup needs to look good. Um, I tried the new Kosas foundation. It's not new, but it's new to me. The Kosas Revealer Foundation. We'll see how it wears, but I really like it. It matches my current skin tone, which is good. Um, I'll show you guys my outfit. I'm still getting used to the new format in my apartment right now. She was like, just live with it, see. It definitely looks good. I definitely miss the mirror over there, and I'm going to see if I like the ottoman on this side. But I told her I'd live with it a little bit and see how I like it. Um, and then the mirror here, so different for OOTDs. I'm like sad. But also, I'm going to fill it out and see. We're going to fill it out. Anyways, here is the fit. Oh, the lighting's kind of weird right now, huh? This dress, I've worn it. I, the thing is, I didn't want to wear this because the last time I wore this, Kelly did my makeup. It was like our first night out together. So I already have photos of Kelly in this, but that's fine. And it's backless. It's from Revolve. I love it. And then I'm just, I made it a little bit more casual with boots. These are from Vince Camuto. I love these so much trying to decide if I'm going to wear a coat or not. Um, and then, yeah, from Kelly's event, which I'm just so excited about. She's launching her new platform. It's going to be so sick. And her look is so good. Like, guys, she looks amazing. From there, I'm going to this dinner for Cloudy Bay Wine. So, very excited. Might get a little tipsy tonight, considering the drinking. We shall see. Um, if I'm feeling it. If I'm not feeling it, I'm not going to do it. I'll have my gold hoops in. And then I'm also going to use my Bottega bag that's actually rented from Vivrel. It's rented from Vivrel. And the event tonight is actually at the Vivrel space here in New York City. So very excited. My friend Seb is going. So she's picking me up in her Uber and we're going to go together. Let's have a night, shall we? Seb's getting a piercing right now. Hi, Katie. Cheers. Everybody, it's Thursday. <laughs> I had such a fun night last night celebrating Kelly. It was just the most special thing. I got to meet her whole family. And who else? I just met like a ton of people. And they were all so sweet. They were like, Kelly has said the best things about you. She really loves you. And I was like, I literally feel the same way. Like, she's such a close friend to me. We're so lucky because we both moved to New York City like the same time. So we just like experienced a lot of the same things at the same time together and I think that brought us really close. And I don't know, we're just really similar. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, who I went to their launch party last night for, Kelly Makeup XKA on Instagram. She's from Texas, you guys would love her. She lives here now. She's a makeup artist, but she also like is an influencer. Like she shows all of her stuff on Instagram. I'm just so proud of her. 
So, so much fun. Drank a little bit there. She had themed drinks, which is so cute. And then uh, from there, went to the Cloudy Bay dinner and it was stunning. You guys, like, it was beautiful. I, I was so honored to be there. I was like, why am I here? Like, it was so regal. It was a 70 person dinner table. I felt like I was at like the Kardashians Thanksgiving. It was like that beautiful. There were like bird noises playing. It was so minimal, yet so chic. V insane views as you guys saw of the city. I could not believe it. Um, so that was really, really special. And Cloudy Bay is going to be my go-to Sauvignon Blanc now, for sure. Um, a lot of the meal was seafood and I ate it. I was so hungry. And you know, it wasn't that bad. I think because it was seasoned so perfectly like the it was lobster, but it was like mixed with potatoes and then the oysters, but they were really well garnished. Is that what the people said? So, I don't know guys. I ate seafood last night, but I did go home and uh, my tummy was like a little confused, but it was delicious. And the main course was lamb. Like it was such a lovely, nice dinner. I was like having imposter syndrome, <laughs> uh, but yeah. I. I I'm a little hungover because that wine is so delicious. Like I just kind of kept drinking it, you know, it's one of those. Uh, and I was having a good time, having good conversations with people. So we're going to have our morning cup of joe. Today is my relaxed day of the week. And I'm really excited because I get to catch up on all of my work. And I just am craving a day where I just like sit in front of my computer and get stuff done and just like also work on like passion project like just other stuff not just like emails and just work on my business think about new video ideas just like stuff like that i'm thinking since i just joined equinox i was gonna try and get a workout in today but my body's kind of sore so i don't want to push it i'm thinking of going to the equinox in hudson yards because that one has a co-working space and I want to take advantage of my membership and I want to check it out there too. It's a little bit of a hike, but I have time in my day. So I'm like, maybe I'll do that. And I can also try out some other amenities. Maybe I'll hop on the bike. I don't really know. But also I have dinner tonight. My manager's in town and I got to like, my hair looks kind of nice. So I don't really want to like get too sweaty. <laughs> so we'll see if I work out. We'll see what I do, but that's the goal. But I am gonna have a nice relaxing morning. Um, my head's kind of hurting, so I don't wanna get right on the computer. Maybe do a face mask, my face feels really dry. I don't know. Just enjoyed the leisurely morning. I've got my Yule log on the TV, and we'll go from there. But, good morning. I put on face moisturizer, like intense lotion, and then my Peace Out skincare puffy eye patches. I'm still getting used to this setup. I'm trying to decide if I want to keep it. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Like, every time I've gone to sit over here, it's just really far. Like, I don't know. It's nice because I can watch TV, I guess. But I haven't, like, eaten over here yet. So I guess that'll be a real test. But then, yeah, I don't know. I'm also getting used to being like chilling in this corner because this is where the L is now. So we'll see. We're gonna give it a go. I'm still giving it a go. I was so tired when I got home last night so I didn't go through the goodie bags, but a little birdie told me the goodie bag from Kelly's party is insane. And then Cloudy Bay gave us something too, which I'm excited about because I loved the wine and I love this bag. So let's, let's look through it. No way, oh my gosh. Katie Jane Hughes makeup brush collection. This is insanity. Wow, this is very, very, very generous. These brushes look amazing. I've been needing some new eyeshadow brushes because I'm trying to get better on my game. Wow, thank you, Kelly. Oh my god, a Stony Clover cosmetic pouch. You guys know I love Stony Clover. Oh, here's a little note from Makeup by Kellyanne. I'm so proud of her. It's so cool. Okay, so it's like a ton of her favorite products. She's literally used so many of these on me. The I should have put this on my face just now. The First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. This is like intense hydration. I need this right now. Oh, thank God. I needed a new one. Ella Lou's Beauty Oil. Kelly introduced me to this stuff. I put it on before my makeup. Incredible. Oh, the First Aid Beauty Niacinamide Brightening Eye Cream. I know Kelly also 
box about this. Ooh, another Ella Luz product. Hand and body lotion. Oh no, not Ella Luz. Lula hand and body lotion. I have to smell it, of course. Wonder if it, usually Kelly likes smelly good things. Oh my gosh. It smells like a spa. You're coming home with me. Well, you're already home with me, but. Tatcha clarifying clay mask. I literally just put Tatcha moisturizer on my face. Love Tatcha. Oh, this is Pat McGrath. An eyeshadow palette. Wow, Kelly, you spoil us. Let's see the colors. Oh my God, these are stunning. Look how beautiful these are. So fun for fall and winter. Wow, this, and I like how compact this is so cute. Oh my God, oh my God, Maggie, her friend Maggie put in jewelry. Wait, I'm so excited because I have triple piercings now and this would look so cute on one of the sides. Wow, that's so sweet. And then lastly, Keys Soul Care. Oh, it's a candle, it's a candle. Sage and oat milk scented candle. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, I can like literally smell it, Kelly. Keys Soul Care, wow. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. Well, thank you, Kelly, very much. Also, I'm gonna briefly open the package from Cloudy Bay. Oh my God, it's a Cloudy Bay scented candle. That is epic. I literally die for candles, so. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. This is good for like, if I'm hosting people, this is a good nighttime scent, wow. I guess it does smell kind of like wine, but not like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna like, ugh. Like, it's like a good smell of wine. Mmm, well, what a fun little <laughs> morning of gifts. I'm very, very appreciative. Um, I'm gonna watch some YouTube videos, drink my coffee, and I did just order food. I did. I uh, need a little bread in me, and I don't have any bread, so, or like just some sort of carb situation i don't really have much because my bread went bad so i ordered a breakfast wrap i've been really into breakfast like breakfast burritos is that the way to say it i don't know watching julia and hunter just got my breakfast burrito and i also got fresh oj gonna enjoy okay i've had my lazy time and now i wanna go i wanna go 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 i wanna go get some work done i'm kind of considering walking but that'll take 40 minutes so i'm like I don't know, I have to decide. But before I leave, I want my apartment to be kind of clean, so, um, and that also just kinda helps me wake up. We're gonna take a shower, put on something comfy to work in. I'm charging my computer right now too, so I don't get there. You know when you go somewhere to work and then you open your computer and it's like, dead. Yeah, we can't have that happen today. I'm gonna make the bed, you know. We're gonna set ourselves up for a success today. That is that on that. So I have the set on from Year of Ours. It's green. It's chilly out, but it actually looks like it's gonna warm up. So we're gonna do layers today. If you guys watched my last, it was like my fall vlog with Brooke. We went to Uniqlo and I bought their like famous heat tech long sleeve. This is the warmest one. So instead of wearing like a huge jacket, I'm just like not in the mood today. I'm just gonna layer up. I'm gonna put this 
over top. I got a size small. This is so warm. Obsessed. And then I really just want to wear this hoodie that I got from this brand called 1111. Like, look, there's a martini with a tennis racket. So cute. Health and social club. <laughs> so I think this should be warm enough with the long sleeve underneath. And it's like a really thick hoodie. So, yeah. I'm wearing a workout outfit in case I decide when I to work out. Like, if I have time before or after. And I also brought an extra set of clothes. It's literally just another workout set. In case, I heard they have like barrel saunas on the roof. And that would just be so nice to do a sauna situation. Um, and like shower there. I've never taken an Equinox shower. So we'll see. Maybe today is the day. Um, so I also need to bring like deodorant. I have in my, I've been packing my tote bag right now. I need to bring deodorant. Um, like a hairbrush, a claw clip. Because I'm not going to wash my hair. Um, what else? Am I like forgetting anything? For like that side of life. And just like whatever shoes I bring. Different pair of socks I guess. But and then I'm bringing my computer, my planner, stuff like that. Um, but you guys do not care. I am sorry about that. But I'm excited. It's a new adventure for me. I got my wallet. Lip balm would be good. All right. Wallet, lip balm. Blue light glasses are going to be necessary. You know, just the things. Oh, my planner, obviously. Doing well, daily baby. And I just, I took one of these pens from American Bar at Nordstrom when I went with Ryan. They were like, it's our last day, please take all the pens. I was like, perfect, I need pens. So yeah, I'm gonna fill up my tote bag now. Then we're gonna head over. I'm really hoping, start over. I'm really hoping I can just get a lot of work done. I really truly am. I really truly am. All right, we are all packed up. I am gonna head to the Equinox in Hudson Yards. I'm gonna try and vlog as much as I can without like being weird. Um, Cause I've never been there before, but I'm really excited to check out the co-working space and just all the amenities. Whatever, here's the fit. Got my Nike super reps on. We're gonna see where the day takes us, but work is priority, so. Got sweet green, looks delicious, and some sparkling water. Sitting outside, and then I'm gonna go back, work a little bit more, and then use the sauna, I think. Okay, so I just got back from Equinox. It was seriously so lovely. I really, really liked it there. Um, and I ended up doing, they had a sauna too, so I did that, and it felt so good. Like, I feel really relaxed right now, so I wanna start doing saunas more. That was really lovely. Um, about to get ready to go to dinner with my manager and some other peeps. Um, and my Luxie hair extension just came in the mail. I was fully inspired by Clara Purse. We just had her on Gals on the Go. You guys should go listen. But she bought these Halo hair extensions. And I got the color Sandy Blonde. And I think I matched perfectly. But basically, I was just about to do it. And I was like, let me vlog and see how this goes. I'm very nervous. You literally just like put this over. And there's like a tiny little invisible line on the top of your head. But then you don't have to worry about clips. But there also are the clip-ins if you want to do that. But I sectioned off my hair. Let's see. Okay. Wow. Oh my god. This reminds me of hair extension Danny. I need to like figure out how to hide. Okay, you can't really see that. Wow. Oh my God, this hair feels so real. Oh, this is just fabulous. Oh my gosh, this is a vibe. Should I wear them out tonight to test? Oh my God, wait. <laughs> wait, I might have not. Oh my God, I don't think I sectioned off enough hair in the back. Did I? Maybe I did. I'm like, how do I make sure this, like, stays, though? And also, you can kind of see that on top, but, like, not too bad. Guys, these are really cool. I just feel like if I move a lot, they might, like, like, I feel it coming up. 
but this is a vibe. I'm impressed, like it looks really good. I probably could have installed them a little bit better, but it's so nice because you don't have to clip them in. Boom, done. This is pretty cool. I don't know if tonight's the night to, I don't know. I wanna like wear these around my apartment more and I only have an hour to get ready, but this is really, I'm very impressed. This looks really good. All right guys, headed to 11 Howard for a drink with my management team that's in town from LA. And then we're going to Bond Street. And I've never been there for dinner. It's sushi. I've heard it's a really cool vibe. Here is my outfit. This dress is from Fashion Pass. I don't want to return it. I'm obsessed. My boots are from Zara. I totally should have put lotion on my legs. Oh, well. We're going side part. I feel like this is giving anchor woman. And I'm kind of here for it. Um, just because it gives a little bit more volume. And I was just taking my middle part for the day. So I'm very excited. Don't know how much I'll vlog. But let's go. Good morning, everybody. It's Friday. I tried so hard last night when I got home to stay up till midnight to hear Taylor Swift's new album, and I just couldn't do it. I literally posted on my Instagram story, eyes are closing, and that's when you know. I read three pages of the book, and I was tired. I shouldn't have done that. But last night was so much fun. Bond Street is so worth it. Suggest eating at the Bond Street Lounge, the downstairs part. It's a little bit more bumping. Food was so good, I ate more seafood. We're having a seafood week, and I can't lie, every morning my stomach's like, huh? But it was really good, I had the sea bass and I enjoyed it. So don't tell my family that though, because they'll try to get me to eat seafood all the time. Anyways, today is photo shoot day for Gals on the Go. We're shooting tons and tons of new merch, launching very soon, and we're also taking some promotional photos for something that we're announcing soon. So, big day, headed to none other than the dry bar, of course, here is my fit actually wearing this sweat set for one of the merch items so you guys shall see um so this set is from aritzia i got it like last year or the year before no i think last year um and then my ugg platform boots I'm gonna throw on a jacket I'm gonna stop at starbucks get myself a breakfast sandwich and yeah we're gonna start the day Big day, the photo shoot location is actually in Brooklyn, the studio we got. So, Brooke is driving us. Brooke is just a driver. I'm excited. We're going to have a fun day. Madison Lane's doing our photos, and it's going to be a good time. All right, I'm late. Let's go. Okay, so I just finished doing my makeup, and I always get nervous to do my makeup for things I'm going to be photographed for. I'm like, don't mess it up, but... I'm pretty happy with how this turned out. I used brown eyeshadow and like an angled brush to use as eyeliner because I just can't do real eyeliner. Um, but wait, I need lip balm. Summer Friday is lip balm. I think I'm just going to wait to do my lips there because there's just no point right now. It's like cold out so my lip balm is hard to squeeze out. I'm doing amazing on timing. I have 20 minutes till I leave. I'm going to actually meet Brooke at her apartment just to make it easier on her because she has to get her car. So now I need to pack all this stuff up and I'm definitely going to bring it with me because you just never know. I'm going to touch up at the studio and we're going to be switching outfits a lot so I know that I'm going to need to touch up. But yeah, I'm going to go pack my bag now I'll show you guys what we have so far. We're shooting tons of new merch. And then like I said, yeah, like we're doing some promo stuff. So I'm bringing shoes, my makeup, my Dyson Airwrap, body lotion. We're using our suitcases for something. Hee <laughs> hee. Bringing this pink dress. So I'm gonna pack all this stuff up and then head to Brooks. But yeah, I'm like, I'm actually pretty proud with the makeup. Like did Kat do my makeup? I don't know. Wow. Sorry, I'm just really proud of myself. Maybe when I actually take the time and like be patient with myself because I was like, I'm gonna give myself a ton of time. I hope this eyeshadow lasts because I'm really proud of myself. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. We're here. We made it. We made it, so excited. We've got our luggage, we're headed to the studio. It's gonna be a good time.
Just got home. I'm making myself lunch with whatever I have. I have bonza, penne pasta, and more green beans. So I'm just cooking away. The shoot was so much fun. I love the new merch. I love the photos. So all is well over here, you guys. Ta-da. Oh my gosh. I die for penne. So I'm very excited about this moment. All right, we're walking all the way over here with my meal. A little weird, but we're gonna try it out. Cheers. <laughs> I love pasta so much. Bon appetit. Oh, I've been waiting to sit on my couch. All right, you guys, that is a wrap for this vlog. I hope you all enjoyed coming along my week in my life. I'm really pooped now. I need to charge my social battery a little bit. This was like a a crazy week, like a fun, lots of fun events and all this. Um, so hope you guys enjoyed. Wasn't as much like at home apartment content, but there's always more. I love you guys. Subscribe if you're new here and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.